You ever seen him? Señor, por favor, I cannot let you in, no matter how many pictures you show me. Don't get defensive, I'm just asking you a question. Look, under no circumstances is anyone allowed inside without a pass or approval from the warden. How come she gets a free pass? If you look like her. Yeah, good point. How about him? You ever seen him? Did you call my brother? No. Wait. I said you were going to help me. I realize I cannot. Not until I find my husband. Listen, I'm not looking for full access. I'm just a cop on a case, and I'm looking for this guy. His name is Chris Vega. Any question about a prisoner? So he's a prisoner here. You'll have to talk to the warden. He doesn't return my calls. He's a busy man. I call the embassy. You know what's going to happen. It's not my problem. I'm making it your problem because you know something, all right? Work with me here and I promise you, you won't go down with all the rest. Do you want to find your husband? Get me out of here. I got to thinking. What's to stop you from just walking away? You leave me in here, you have nothing. And I'm a dead man. You know, your husband managed to tick off every player in this house. I don't get out of here soon. One of them's going to kill me. That's right. Charming is out. Then call my brother. So he can call the FBI? They don't care about my husband. I'm an American. They care about me. <laughs> Do you know how many stupid Americans are riding away in our prison? Nobody cares about you. I am telling you, my brother will He's make... a fine man, I'm sure. But what happens when his friend at the FBI tells him that he can't help him? When he goes to a senator, a reporter, your picture ends up on the television, and then every crooked official in this country will put his hand out. So that's it. I spend the rest of my life in this hellhole and you go on your merry way? Now did I say that? Your honor. Do you want, um, do you want the television remote? No. How about I uh, put on some music? No, 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 no. Okay. I spoke to John. I think he's already in Colombia. Colombia? He's following up on a lead. He should be getting back to us really soon with, with probably good news, I'm sure. You two should be on the case. Not just sitting around here with me. No, what? And, and, and miss my, my daughter's first soccer match? No way. What's all this? Food. Well, ingredients. We were missing all that home cooking from the diner, so we decided to stop by and whip up some tostones and empanadas for everyone. Uh, tostones, maybe, but you guys know how to make empanadillas? Well, we know how to read. Oh. We bought a cookbook. And what kind of flour are you using for the dough? You know, dough. Flour. Dough flour. You have to use yucca flour. So there is such a thing as yucca flour. Yeah. Uh, me. If, if you really want to make empanadillas, I'll show you guys how. Okay? I, I, th I think I have some uh, uh, yucca flour in the cup. No, no, no. We need to have the yuca flour, we need manteca, and we need um, huevos, and we need cebolla, and we need pimiento, and... I told you, I haven't seen them. Let's take another look. What is the significance of all this? He is asking a North American. And what did he say? Nothing, there's nothing to say. The devil is a bear, the devil is a bear, the devil is a bear, the devil is a bear. My name is McBain, John McBain, so how about you stop jerking me around? I know these two men were here. I just want to know where they are now. I won't contact you, brother, but I will get you out of here. My way. If you promise to do something for me in return. You see? You feel how spongy? Mm-hmm. 
Mm. That's the yuca. So, Remy, tell me why your boyfriend never taught you the finer points of Puerto Rican cuisine. Uh, I, I, no, you don't have to defend yourself. No, it's not Sarah's fault. No, my Christian is very secretive in the kitchen. Well, well I thought you taught him everything he knows. Oh, I did. Um... You see, after I taught him everything he knows, he improved upon it, my little cooker. As a matter of fact, do you want to know a little secret? Always. <laughs> my famous plum? Christian was the one who improved the recipe. Get out of town. No, it's true. <laughs> it is the truth. <laughs> You know, when he started making it, he would add something, and for the longest time, he wouldn't tell me what it was. So, what is it? Yes, what? Hmm, I think, I think I'll let him tell you when my little cooker comes home. I should have listened to my father. Carl? I think, what, are you kidding me? If I'd listened to him, all of his theories about revenge, all of his talks about ruthlessness, I had the shot. I had the chance to put a bullet in his head more than once. And if I'd done that, if I'd acted like a hesser, none of this would have happened. So you'll help me find my husband? I swear. On the life of your mother. I swear, on the life of my mother, who is very, very dear to me, that I'll help you find your husband. You can trust me. I'm going to have to, aren't I? I was told that a Senora Montes had something for me. No, me have go, go no mano. Use your hands. Uh, no, no more. Don't be cheap. We have to take him out. Yeah, it's the only way. Look. Otherwise, the next time it could be your mom ah. or Jamie. Mira, no. I brought this. Brought this all on your family. No. No, you didn't. My family has a history with your father. Yeah, well, it all stops here. Right. I think that you and I would be better off not emulating our fathers. Okay, honey, what are we supposed to do? Supposed to find him, capture him, lock him up? We've tried that. It didn't work. He escaped. Good job. I was supposed to keep him from hurting anyone else. That was the deal. That's why I went into law enforcement. No, you went into law enforcement because you're nothing like him. Hey, you are nothing like him, okay? You're good and strong and ethical. He's already paid. He lost you. And... And as far as his criminal career goes, he's just going to have to go with us, okay? Well, this looks fantastic. <laughs> Thank you. And we've even made vegetarian empanadas, especially for mi querida Sarita. <laughs> Thank you. Empanada. Thanks for the cooking lesson. Oh, anytime. Antonio? Lord, we thank you for this wonderful meal and for our friends, for our family. And we ask you, Lord, to protect my brother, Christian, and to bring him home safely. Amen. Amen.
He was right here, the, the man you were looking for, the one in the picture. 